very cool. What I really love about this is that I just got my five daily servings of vegetables. Three or four servings. It is 2.45, my friend should be here any second to pick me up and then we will go to the Dandenong Ranges. I'm actually pretty pleased with myself because I managed to do a parallel, like a reverse parallel park. The only space I could fit into was this really tiny spot. And I was like, no, I can't ever fit in there. But you know what? If you reverse it, it works. That's what I was told. So I gave it a try, got it the first time. So I met up with my friend way too late and we couldn't go to the ranges. So instead, we came to the, what is this place called? The, the airport. I have no idea actually, exactly what it's called. The place at the airport where you watch the planes take off and you watch the planes come in. The viewing plane place. <laughs> of it came off in the pan. So what is the main story right now? Hmm. Trying out the gimbal. And you don't want to talk about the gimbal. Ooh, the sunset looks great. What's this bird doing?
Yesterday I had one of these for the first time, which is, you know, it's a McDonald's iced latte. Simple, right? Oh. When you have something really good and it's very accessible to you, and then you, you have that moment where you realize, oh no, what have I done to myself? You've discovered something and now you know you're going to go get it um, probably every single day. So I think what's most motivating to leave my car right now is actually that I can go buy one of these. <laughs> Everything is so accessible all around us. So I'm going to check the maps and see where the closest McDonald's is. Okay, so I finally made it out of the car and the closest McDonald's is 30 minutes away. I know I could go anywhere for a coffee and I could go to a really nice place for a coffee because this is Melbourne, but I want that exact flavor that I had yesterday. actually amazing. 